How long can you drive with a broken oxygen sensor? Oxygen sensors in cars are becoming increasingly common as fuel efficiency and emission standards increase. However, oxygen sensors can be a source of error, potentially leading to engine failure. A broken oxygen sensor can cause a car to stop running and can be a serious safety issue. With a broken O2 sensor, you can still drive for a few hundred kilometers. However, you should expect a considerable drop in fuel consumption as well as poor engine performance, such as rough idling, stalling, and other issues. This can occur in any vehicle, although it is more common in older vehicles, particularly those with higher miles. To minimize catastrophic damage, such as catalytic converter failure, it is suggested that it be changed as soon as possible. You can drive a car with a broken oxygen sensor for a few days without having a big negative impact on your car. But if you drive for a longer time, it may cause damage to the catalytic converter, which can cost anywhere from $1,000 to $3,000 in parts and labor. If you intend to bring your automobile to your mechanic for analysis and replacement, you should only drive it with a bad O2 sensor. Finally, driving without fully functional and unaltered O2 sensors is illegal. It is recommended that whenever you find a bad or damaged sensor in the vehicle, go for an inspection. After the confirmation of the defect, repair or replace it as soon as possible to avoid any inconvenience. In conclusion, a broken oxygen sensor will not cause your car to break down immediately. You can drive for a few days with a broken oxygen sensor. However, it is not advisable to do so as it can lead to further damage to your car. If you have a broken oxygen sensor, you should take it to a mechanic to get it fixed as soon as possible. A broken oxygen sensor can decrease your gas mileage and increase your emissions, so it's best to take care of the problem right away. Thanks for watching. And subscribe to Easy Car Electrics for more details.